Hello beauties and welcome to the channel. I'm Jessica Yick, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we are doing a hair shampoo review. So let's do this. Yeah. So this product was launched at Avon Canada in Campaign 20 of this year, so a few months ago, and this is the Elastin Perfume in Fresh Citrus. This is a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner, and it is a total of 250 ml. I ridiculously love this packaging. You are currently in my bathroom, so you know I'm getting in the shower. Uh, but I'm doing it a little bit differently this time. I'm not to 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 mitigate the amount of editing I need to do because there was some strategy involved in the last one because I forgot about reflection. So we're doing it a little bit differently this time around. Yeah, I'm also a little bit congested sounding because I'm on the tail end of a cold thanks to my lovely family who believe sharing is caring. Mommy got the last bit of the the, the sharing part of it, so here we are. I have Miss Ginevra here today. Say hi. Hi. She just wanted to hang out. We're not going to shampoo her hair. There are a total of three different sets available in this particular collection. This is the one that Avon sent me for free as a gift because I took part and watched the webinar for the Q4 training. It's about products and everything that's coming out during our fourth quarter. Exciting times, very much so. So they sent me like $300 worth of product. <laughs> so I figured that I need to wash my hair before dance class today because it's kind of gross. So I feel like it's like this would be perfect. Regular price of these are $23. And all in all, there are three different scents in this collection. This one here is called Fresh Citrus and it has top notes of lime, grapefruit, and orange. Yum. And then the middle notes are eucalyptus mint, and then the final notes are musk and woody notes. The other one that they have is uh, the pink one is called Love Me. It looks very romantic, very pretty. And that one has jasmine, ylang ylang, but it doesn't tell me all three of the top notes, middle notes, and bottom notes from the website so if you are interested in trying out click the link in the description box to go to the e-store and then the final one that they have is um, called pure breeze and that one has white rose and Bulgarian rose all three of them are free of sulfates and parabens it's suitable for daily use and the other thing is that it does moisturize your hair while controlling oil derived odors so if your hair smells oily this is supposed to help Apparently, this is formulated with a special patented two-in-one technology that helps to hydrate your hair for a smoother hair finish while infusing your hair with a long-lasting, delightful scent. I love the sound of this scent, so I am really excited to try it out. I typically do reach for the more citrusy, fruity uh, type of body washes and, and shampoos, although, although, although my current favorite one is the cherry blossom one with the hyaluronic acid. That one is my absolute favorite one as of right now. However, we're going to find out with this. I typically very rarely ever use a two-in-one shampoo, to be honest with you. I find that with my particular hair, I do need the extra conditioner or a hair mask. However, when I'm in a rush, a two-in-one shampoo could definitely be a lifesaver. It would definitely be a huge time saver, so I am looking forward to trying this out. I want to see how soft it makes my hair, as well as after I dry my hair, what is the level of frizz like? So let's open up this Berber. This is Korean made as part of our K-Beauty line. And I've never seen this before on a shampoo, on any of the shampoos I've purchased anyways. There's an expiration date. So this one ends in 2025, tons of time. Here it is. It is actually quite big. I was thinking 250 ml would be a little bit on the small side, but it is fairly large. So mm, I have a big head. So there you go. You can compare it to the size of my head. <laughs> <laughs> so the instructions of this, very simple, very straightforward. Wet your hair, lather, and rinse. That's it. First off, let's do a bit of a sniff test. So here it is sealed. Proof that I have not pre-sniffed it. I hope I can smell though because I am pretty congested. All right. Smells very sour and orangey. Yes, I love it. It smells very bright, citrusy, and orangey. Mmm, I like it. And it has like a little bit of um. Um, 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 like a minty note to it. I think it is the, the eucalyptus and the mint coming through, but it's ever so light right now. I think this will feel very refreshing on your head. And I wonder, none of the three did say that is specific for any sort of particular hair type. So I have oilier roots and drier ends. So we're going to see how this works. So here's my hair right now. I am going to first wet my hair. I'm not taking you guys in the shower this time, but I'm just going to hang my head over the top and do it. So let's go. All right, my hair is a dripping. Yeah. Do you see? 
I have wet my hair. And so now let's try seeing how sudsy it is. I typically do wash my hair twice. Mommy. Yes, baby. Why did you sponge your hair like, like, like you're there washing you it when you didn't even wash it? I didn't wash it yet. Oh, okay, I just it. wet it so that I can wash it. All right. Oh my gosh, I love the smell of this. It's great. Eh? Okay, so. It smells like my toothpaste. It smells like your toothpaste. Apparently my hair smells like your toothpaste. Ha ha ha. Feels good on the scalp. Yeah, I'm definitely not soaping sudsing up as well as I normally do because my hair is quite greasy. I did not wash my hair yesterday. I don't wash my hair every day. I typically wash it every two to three days. I'm going to do a really quick rinse and then we're going to wash it a second time to see how much it sets. Now I've heard a couple of different things that sudsing is does not indicate how clean it's gonna get your hair. I don't know if that's true or not, so you're gonna have to do your own research on that. But I love the feeling of the suds. And I'm gonna show you another tool in a second. What else I really love. First rinse is done, we're going to shampoo it twice now. We have an added little guest here now. Say hi Nathaniel. Hi, he's very curious as to why mommy's washing her hair like this. Like I say, I normally do shampoo my hair twice because I do have an oilier skull. Mommy, mommy, yeah? what are you doing? Washing my hair. Does it smell nice? Smell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, see how it's sizzling up a little bit better now? I think that the, the first time my scalp was just too oily. Just too oily. And so now it's doing better. Something I love to do is really to use this thing here. So this one, we, I don't think we have it right now, but we, we have another one. I think it's like a mauvey color. But anyways, I love this. This is the scalp massager and I just use it. And it just feels so good. The nubs just feel absolutely amazing against my scalp. And I just feel like it, it cleans my hair so much better. I'm really loving the mintiness of this i just think it feels so good see how much more suds there are oh, it feels really great against the scalp as i was rinsing it the first time i was impressed with um how easily my my fingers did run through my hair so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to rinse this off and then i'll be right back all right so here we are hair is washed rinsed twice through what i normally do then i tie it up into my little head thingy. This is like a microfiber hair towel. I love this. I actually have well, how many? Four of them now, I think. What I did notice is, especially if I, was, if I was taking a full shower, I feel like this would be an absolute beautiful aromatherapy experience. The smell and the scent really did fill up my shower space. It was really, really, really lovely. It was that little bit of bright citrusy nose. I think it would just be something that would perk me up in the morning or if I'm feeling tired, like right now. It actually gave me that little burst of like, whew, that little pep in my step, so it was really great. What I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna take it down, try to run my fingers through my hair, Typically, I have a little bit of knotting going, but you know what though? Lately, my hair has been really, really good because I have been using the Hyaluronic Acid Shampoo. I feel like that that product, it just works so well for my hair and it smells so lovely. So I'm curious to see how this one holds up against it. I'm gonna let it air dry as per normal, and then we're going to see how fluffy my hair gets. Let's do the finger test. So my hair has been up. Alright, not bad. Just a little bit of resistance. As you can see, I'm still having hair fallout. It's not as bad as it was. Um, I don't know what's, what's causing it, but it's not as bad as it used to be, so that's a good thing. My hand does go through my hair quite easily. <laughs> and um, the it doesn't feel quite as silky as if I use a shampoo or a hair mask, like an in-shower hair mask. So it's not quite as silky as that. Sun twice smells nice. Do you smell anything like Come smell. Mmm. Smell my head. Mm. What do you think? I like the little hair part better. You like the hair part better than my head part? Okay, so she doesn't like the smell of my scalp. We are going to be back. I'm going to continue on with my day. I'm going to let this dry. Typically what I do, I just kind of let it out and then I part it. And if I can remember to, I give my ends a little twist like so. And I just let it try. So, we'll be back in a few hours. All right, it's been a bit of time now. It's been maybe about 
an hour and a half, which is typical of how long it takes my hair to dry. Overall, not bad. Not It kept the fluff pretty tame. I do notice it's not quite as soft as if I did like the full shampoo, conditioner, or a hair mask. But I mean, for a quick and dirty, this is great. It's great for on the go. It's great for those, you know, I just need to get in, out, fast, 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 because like my hair isn't tangly. It is still quite soft. Well, another thing I want to mention about this particular product, it is quite light, the scent. When I first opened it, you could really smell the citrus and everything, but it's not to the point where it's tickling my nose and I feel like I'm going to have an asthma attack or it's going to like bother my mom when she comes and sees me because I don't feel that the scent is that, that strong. But according to Ginevra, there is a bit of a scent, which is nice. If I try to smell my hair right now, it smells really fresh. I did really like the mintiness um, of it. It wasn't so minty that I felt a tingle on my scalp or anything like that, but it was quite pleasant. My scalp feels nice and clean. The fact that it is a two-in-one conditioner, it doesn't feel like it weighed down the roots of my hair at all, which is nice, but that's also probably why I usually just do conditioner from my ears down to really tame the mane. <laughs> Overall, I am quite pleasant pleased with it. It gives like this a bit of like a, my natural wave, which is nice. And like I said, typically how I dry my hair is I leave it down like so and I do a bit of a twist and that's how I let my hair dry. Um, it's like, it's not like that whole too much of a triangle thing. The only real difference is that I feel it's not quite as soft as if I were to do a, my regular conditioning process. The other thing is not quite as shiny as if I were to do a conditioner. But it could also be the lighting because it is evening now. Compared to our previous two-in-one shampoo, this one is definitely better. I, I find that it cleans better and also I feel that it does make my hair smoother than our previous uh, advanced technique two-in-one shampoo. So I do like it better in complete transparency. The two-in-one shampoo from previous, although it was a fan favorite, was never one of my personal favorite shampoos from Avon. But this one, it's, it's nice. I would definitely use this again, especially if I need a really quick on the go or if I'm traveling. I don't want to take both my shampoo and conditioner. This will definitely come in handy. So if you're interested in finding one of these for yourself, make sure you do go to the link in the description box below. And if you have any questions about it, leave a comment and I'll do my very, very, very best to answer them. And until next time, guys, stay well, stay safe, and stay fantastic. Kind. I love you so very, very much. Bye! I caught that on camera.